Hi everybody, uh, my name is François Grassard, I'm French. Uh, this is my first video on YouTube in English, so uh, I want to apologize if my uh, English is not perfect from time to time. Um, I, I'm living near Paris, really close to Paris, and as millions of people in France know, I'm stuck at home because of the coronavirus. And um, a lot of my friends ask me uh, if a, a way to communicate and to work with other people uh, without installing any, any application or um, creating an account somewhere. Uh, of course, you can use Skype or Zoom or something like that, but for older people, it's sometimes difficult to understand maybe how to install a software on a computer. So uh, there, there is a solution uh, named Meet GT or GT, simply GT. GT was previously a standalone application. Uh, you have to install it. On, on your computer, but it's uh, it's not the case today. It's uh, a web browser services, uh, free services and secure services. You don't need any kind of account or any kind of uh, uh, application. So you just have to go to uh, meet.jit.si, uh, okay, jitc, yeah, there's, there's a, uh, a, a dot there. And uh, you just have to type what you want here. Uh, for instance, I want, to talk with you, okay, and uh, you can you can leave the spaces here uh, because when you are going to click on go or simply press uh, enter, uh, the space will be removed. Okay, so um, take a look at the address now. Okay, here uh, you can see that um, GC just add I want to talk with you here. Okay, and uh, actually you, you can type what you want. Okay, so um, in this case I enter exactly the same name uh, with the application instead of my smartphone. Okay, but of course you just have to copy and paste uh, the link and send send it to. Uh, and other people, okay, to, just to communicate with them. Uh, the application is available for Android and iPhone, so feel free to download it, it's free, and it's really, really helpful. Uh, so, um, I'm not going to explain all the, the settings, the, all the parameters available in the application, just two things. Uh, the first one is uh, video quality, uh, manage video quality actually. Uh, the most important in this case is um, the bandwidth you can have uh, at home. And uh, sometimes you have to reduce the definition and the quality of the video to be, um, to, to don't have any lag you know, between uh, you and, uh, and, the, and the people you are going to talk about. So um, you can uh, choose low definition, standard definition, high definition, okay. Low bandwidth, it's only uh, when you want to use only your microphone and not, not your webcam. Uh, you, can, uh, you can, of course, disconnect your webcam, but if you use the low bandwidth parameters, your webcam will be uh, disabled. Okay, so I'm going to go back to high definition and uh, you can uh, stream this uh, conference through uh, YouTube by using your uh, uh, streaming key. Okay, but it's not, it's not the topic of this video today. Um, the other interesting thing here is, uh, of course, you have a, a chat. Okay, you just have to uh, enter a name here, Francois, that's my name, and say hello to other people. Okay, and you can also share some of your application and even the whole screen, okay, of your computer. So, uh, in this case, I'm going to share uh, uh, one of the 3D applications I use. This is Blender in my case. Um, and I can see now if I can put the two applications side by side and click on this uh, icon, okay, with a small square, uh, I can see the video of all participants of the conference. Uh, and you can see here, you don't see my face now, but you see my screen, yeah, more precisely this application, okay, only this application. You can choose different application and uh, when you start to share an application, you have uh, this button, it's in French here because I use a French Windows, but uh, uh, you have a stop share in your case, okay, so you can simply uh, click on stop share, okay, and your webcam is back, okay. So um, that's the most important thing here. You can, of course, disable the camera and only use GC uh, for audio, okay? You can mute your audio, of course. And um, actually, the most important to understand here is 
it's a direct direct communication between you and other people okay it's not going through any kind of server uh, such as uh, it's a case for uh, Skype or, or not Zoom. Zoom is not the case, but Skype is the case. Uh, if you send the video to Skype, um, Skype has a server, a Microsoft server, and all the video go to Microsoft, and all the image are composite, okay, to create this uh, all this image at the same place. Okay, it's not the case when you use GT because GT directly sends the image and the sound of your webcam uh, to to other people without passing through any kind of server. Okay, to explain the concept, I, I, I find this presentation. Um, you have the first people here, okay, uh, and other people here. Actually, GT work well uh, in Chrome and uh, Firefox and even Edge. I already use uh, GT in Edge, but uh, when you want to share screen, uh, you, you have less bug with Chrome than Firefox for now. But it's if you want only want to communicate by using your webcam and your microphone firefox is good also okay so um you send your video to the other people and other people send the video to you so if you add another people okay everyone shares video and send his part of the video to other people so if you have another people it's more complex other people is more complex and it's more complex, but actually it's not a technical issue. Okay, it's just a bandwidth issue. You have you have to have a better connection actually to handle more and more and more people, but you don't have any kind of restriction. Okay, um, if you want to uh, communicate with someone and only for one time, only one shot, uh, you can use, for instance, passwords generator. In this case, you just have to uncheck the first box here, okay, and generate a unique ID, okay, unique ID, and uh, just copy it after meet GT, after slash, okay. So now I'm uh, in a new uh, new conversation. Of course, I'm at home because my smartphone is not connected on the same identifier okay here and um, when you want to talk with someone for instance one of my friends work in a travel agency and uh, she has to talk with people to get them back in France you know and uh, she just want to talk with them only one time so she generate a call like this and send them the link so they can communicate together of course she turn off uh, his webcam she she only wants uh, his microphone and uh, after that she don't use the the same link it's okay okay uh, it's better than sending your whatsapp to someone or something because it's it's related to your phone number okay uh, so um by, by this way you can only communicate with one people only one time and throw throw the link away okay so i hope this uh, really humble and little video will be uh, useful for everyone and take care of you uh, and, and listen to the doctor when they say you have to stay at home, that's really important. Okay, take care. Bye.